so now that i've shown you how i prepare the aloe vera i'm going to show you how i make the aloe vera gel for my hair specifically and then i'm going to pre-poo my hair and prepare it for wash day tomorrow so i'm not going to wash it today i'm going to leave it overnight so let me show you how i make the gel and then come back and show you how i pre-poo using the gel and my hot oil treatment okay so basically you want to take your little piece and then cut out the spiky bits on both ends with the sides that is and then you can choose to either cut on like one of the sides and then scrape the entire bottom but i'm just gonna cut in the center it's safer i'm not good with knives okay so i have my little um cap for the blender because basically all of this is going to be blended to make the gel so i'm gonna scrape out the rest of the gel if you can see over there all of the white stuff is gel i'm gonna scrape all of that out and then just throw it in my blender. There are some of the, a few green ones from where I didn't cut it out perfectly, but it's fine because once I've blended this, I'm going to sift it out anyways. So I'm not going to get any of this in there, just a nice slimy goopy uh, jelly part. So you want to add a little bit of water to this, for mainly for my blender, but also just so you can get, um, you. it'll be easier for you to extract the gel. I'm not going to use water because I've got this store-bought aloe vera juice, so I feel like it'll dilute the aloe vera less if I'm using this Okay, so I have my hot water bath to warm up my oils and this is my little mixture of oils. I've got coconut oil, olive oil and tea tree essential oil in here. So it's just going to live in here for a little bit to get warm and then I'm going to keep it here while I use it um, so that it stays warm. And then I've transferred my aloe vera gel into this because of the 
um, little nozzle so I can concentrate the mixture onto my scalp. And I've got my crusty hair that really does need a lot of TLC. So let's first get this hair into four sections. Okay, and now that that's out of the way, I'm going to use my pre-poo on my scalp and give myself a little scalp massage. Now I'm just going to dip the tips of my fingers in the oil and just focus it on my ends. Okay, that's it. I'm gonna tie my hair back and put it in a plastic bag and wrap it for the night and then I will wash it tomorrow. But it already feels really soft. 